Good morning and welcome to today's uh, talk or online seminar about our master's program, Technical Management. And um, I'm very glad to see that we have a lot of guests already. Maybe some more will join us in a couple minutes, but that's a good start, I'd say. Before we start, I'd just like to introduce myself really quickly. My name is Larissa. You can use my first name and I'm working in the study orientation and advisory program at uh, the Technical University of Wildau. So yeah, I'm here for some general questions, but luckily I have two experts on technical management here with me today. So we have Professor Jens Bollenweber who agreed that we can call him Jens for today. So good morning. I'm Hello, good morning. very happy that you're here to present the program this morning. <laughs> yeah, thank you very much, Larissa. And um, yeah, good morning uh, again from my side. Um, I'm Jens Wollenweber. I'm at uh, University of Applied Sciences uh, Wildau, um, professor for transport logistics. And uh, I'm also responsible for our master program technical management. Um, in the next uh, few minutes, I will um, yeah, give you an in introduction into the program. I will tell you about the, the uh, contents we will have in our master program. And I will also uh, tell you something about the um, yeah, application requirements we, we need to, if you are interested in. Um, technical management is uh, the only master program at our university, which is uh, held completely in English. And um, we are focusing on um, people with an engineering background. And um, our, our goal is basically to um, combine this um, engineering background with um, some uh, additional knowledge, uh, for instance, on business administration. We will have also some uh, more mathematical oriented uh, courses. And um, you will have a very practical um, approach here. Um, we will do a lot of our teaching in, in, in the form of projects. And um, I think this makes our master program um, kind of unique. Um, University of Applied Sciences Wildau is a university for applied sciences. We have um, around 300 uh, 50 um, employees and um, around uh, 100 professors. So it's a yeah, kind of medium-sized uh, University of Applied Sciences. Um, two faculties and our master program uh, takes place in the Faculty of Engineering and Natural Sciences. In total, we have uh, 15 bachelor programs and 15 master programs. And uh, you can find us uh, very close uh, to um, the capital of Berlin and the um, south, southeast from the city center. Um, I think we, we can offer uh, your excellent um, your opportunities for, for doing um, a master program. We have innovative courses, a very practice-oriented curriculum, and um, we are working um, in, in many courses in our um, labs, which uh, makes, um, makes the, um, yeah, the, the stuff, the courses more, more interesting. And of course, we already have a lot of international partnerships uh, with uh, around 70 um, universities uh, all over the world. And um, yeah, this is uh, also something you can um, yeah, do in a master program, something like an exchange program. So um, for uh, for the general information, um, I already told you we have, we are doing an engineering master. So when you are graduating, you will be a master of engineering. The uh, master program is uh, three semesters, and in general, we offer thirty five places. Um, so thirty five student places, but um, we we are not limited yet in our number of student places. So basically, when you apply and you meet the um, application requirements, you can be sure that in 2021 you will um, have uh, a place in this master program. 
Um, the language is completely English, and um, yeah, our program focuses mainly on um, graduates um, who have done their bachelor studies in, yeah, in particular in industrial engineering, logistics, or in transportation systems. Um, we are also open for graduates from other programs. Um, for this, we have some special application requirements. I can tell you later if you are interested. Yeah, as, uh, and also as I introduced, our study objective is that we would like to train highly qualified people with interdisciplinary um, knowledge, especially in mathematics and uh, yeah, engineering or in technical stuff, and as well um, in business administration. So um, this is a, a very nice and a very up-to-date combination of, of different um, yeah, streams of, of knowledge, and uh, I think this is uh, this is a good um, yeah, addition to to a former bachelor study, which uh, might have been a little more focused on uh, yeah, on engineering topics. Um, yeah, I told you that uh, our program comp comprises of um, three uh, semesters. Um, you can see here the, the general um, chart. So in the first semester, which is always the summer semester, our summer semester starts at uh, March 1st. And the lectures start uh, yeah, around uh, mid-March, so around uh, March 15. Um, in the first semester, we will have um, uh, yeah, normal semesters with different courses, which are um, pretty much the same for, for all students. And um, in the next semester, in the winter semester, we um, offer three different specializations. We offer a specialization production, a specialization logistics and a transportation specialization. In this specialization, I will show you, we have uh, six different modules um, and um, yeah, they, they focus on this mentioned um, topics here, production, logistics and transportation. And in the third semester, we you will do um, your master thesis and also defend your master thesis. And then it's, uh, it's a very, very quick uh, master program with uh, three semesters only. Um, there is one speciality. This is the so-called certificate module. Um, this module is, is something which focuses mainly on graduates from our university, um, in particular um, to, uh, on graduates in industrial engineering, because those graduates have only a six semester bachelor program and um, one entry requirement for our master program is a seven semester bachelor. And um, yeah, with this certificate module, students from industrial engineering um, can um, add uh, 30 credits to their to the bachelor and uh, qualify for this master program. Um, theoretically, the certificate module is also good for people from abroad who also offer a six semester bachelor. But uh, to be honest, we have to tell you that uh, the certificate module is mainly taught in German. And um, so for this, um, you, you, you need uh, very good German knowledge. And uh, this is, I, I know, some, some kind of um, hazard uh, for people from ab abroad. Um, let's have a quick look into the, the different uh, courses in the different semesters. So uh, in the first semester, I already told you we have um, courses for all students together. We have a um, um, course on optimization where we are doing mathematical optimization operations research. We have a course on advanced management techniques, techniques where you learn uh, more um, or yeah, more, more deeply on project management, business process optimization, and also on simulation and visualization. And um, one very, uh, very large module, um, which is 50% of this first semester, is the design, engineering, and management of companies module, where you are working on a, on a semester um, project uh, where, where you are modeling a company from uh, yeah, at, at each stage, from the supply over production to the distribution of goods. 
So this is the, the first semester. And in the second semester, you have the, the choice uh, between three specializations, um, logistics, production, and transportation. Um, and I think we have a very interesting um, course program. Um, you can see here the different courses here. I think it's, uh, it's, it would take too much time to introduce each course in, in detail. And um, yeah, I, we, we will offer um, this information also um, offline later on. So you can have a look at it. And we have also uh, our uh, module um descriptions where you can uh, get more information on this on this courses in general um in each specialization we have uh, six different courses um each uh, worth five credit points and um this is done um in the winter semester the third semester as uh, as i already told you is the uh, semester where you are writing your master thesis it's a uh, scientific work with uh, which takes uh, five months and um, in this master thesis you you are free to to work on a, a real scientific um, topic on a more theoretical topic or you can also do a an applied topic uh, many students in our university are doing this uh, combined with a company and um, this is also an interesting and good experience you can um, do in this master thesis so this is in in a nutshell um the the program itself um if you have questions on the contents we can answer this later on and um now let's proceed uh, to the um admission requirements um the admission requirements are um very simple for the students from from our university so if you have a bachelor in logistics uh, or transportation systems engineering um then you have the um yeah the the sufficient um number of credit points which are 200 and 10. If you are graduating from industrial engineering, you have to do the certificate module in order to obtain the missing 30 credit points. Um, if you are from um, another university um, or from abroad, then um, you might also qualify. In uh, that case, you also need 210 credit points, and you also need um, yeah, some, some certain um, background. And um, this, this background, we are counting this in a certain number of modules which are listed in our admission requirements. And if you have uh, yeah, five of these listed modules, then uh, you also qualify for, for our master program program. Um, something which is uh, yeah, in many cases asked, um, professional job experience um, is yeah, unfortunately no criterion for the admission. So even if you have a lot of experience in the uh, correct field, um, yeah, this, this doesn't uh, yeah, improve your application requirements. We are just um, focusing on your bachelor degree. Um, the second um, serious um, admission requirement is uh, your your command of very good English. So we are requiring um, a level of C1 in the European frame framework. And um, also in our admission requirements, you can see the different ways to um, yeah to qualify in in this in this field. Um, basically, we are accepting a different number of of tests like TOEFL, LCCI, ILTS, and so on. And um, if you did your master or your bachelor program already completely in English, then this is also um, good for our application requirements. Next, um, the application period. Um, this takes place from December 15th to January 15th, so it's already open. If you're um, graduated in Germany, you can do a direct application at our university. If you are an international student, you have to um, use UniAssist, which uh, will revise and evaluate your bachelor certificate and um, yeah, pass this over to us if you meet um, in general the admission requirements. 
we are doing uh, then a um, uh, second check on your uh, bachelor certificate but um yeah re you have to know that in, in the first time you have to apply using uni assist um here um I, I know this is something um yeah serious for for many people because only assist has some some um, fee for for their for their services which is i think 75 euros and um i'm yeah i'm approached by a lot of questions from from international students who are asking um is my bachelor program um yeah sufficient for for application and um yeah yeah, to be honest, um, I, I cannot um, yeah, officially um, answer this question. So the best way um, to pre-check is um, the first uh, requirement is um, that you have an engineering um, bachelor. And the second requirement is that you ch check our list of required modules. And if you meet this module, then your your chances um, are, are good enough to do this application using UniAssist. Um, the good information or the good news is um, that uh, we as um, uh, public university, we have no tuition fees. Um, university only charge semester fees, which are approximately 320 euros per semester. And in this 320 euros, there's already a public transport ticket included, which uh, yeah, makes the, or offers you um, free transport in the Berlin capital region. Okay, so this is a lot of information here, and um, I'm sure I, I could not yet uh, answer all of your possible questions. Here is uh, my my contact data. You see my my email address, and um, there's also a link to our university website and especially to our course website and um, there you can find um, more information on our courses.